welcome back to Italy, and this time we're back here with some updates on our lives. Yeah, so this is for all you guys that have been following us for a long time, or for those of you who maybe have just joined us and want to know something about us, I guess. Yeah, and if you're new, just go back and watch all the other videos and then watch this one as well. There we go, then you'll know us more. But we hope that now you'll be able to know us more and we'll be able to give you an update on what we're up to and what we're going to be up to in the next like month or so. So, I would start probably from uh, our wedding, well, uh, ceiling. Ceiling? Yes, because... So, what is the ceiling or how they? Yeah, so in our church, we get married twice, well, at least in Europe, because in America, you can get married just once. The second marriage for us is the eternal marriage, so we just get married for the eternity. Which uh, means that when we die, we're still married. We are married for the eternity now. <laughs> you can't escape. Married forever. <laughs> forever. So, and that was actually amazing. It was really nice and spiritual moments. Yeah, so we, we went had. to England for that, to London. Oh yeah. And Ricardo's family came over and I met my family over there already. Mm -hmm. So we stayed there for a few days after. Actually, really nice weather as well. Oh my goodness, it was so hot. It was hotter than like, it was here. What, was we, all, we had it all like packed like jumpers. We were ready for the cold, like <laughs> even I was ready for the cold. And then we didn't wear any of it, and most people, although you, had only brought long sleeves. Oh my goodness. So Ricardo could only wear long sleeves. Me. Last weekend, we also went to Pescara, maybe it's two weekends ago from when the time you're watching this video. We went to Pescara because there was a holiday day, a uh, Republica day. Yeah. Um, so I had the day off, so we went with some friends and we went camping on the beach in Pescara. Well, well it wasn't Pescara, yeah. but you know. It was kind of close to Pescara. I say Pescara because it's like main as Francavilla Mare. Francavilla Mare, yeah, but it was first actually the idea to go just us, but then yeah. all the other friends. Well, we invited them. Yeah. It kind of opened it up to them. Yeah, so. yeah. It was actually nice. I yeah. think it was nice. We decided to sleep on a beach, even if you're not really that allowed to do it, but we were on a public beach, so it yeah. wasn't private, and uh, it was awful. I don't think I will ever do that again. Well, if you want to find out about that, that's as much as we can tell you because we're going to have a video out for you in the next few coming weeks. I don't know when. Yeah, as soon as Some we point. can. Because the other problem is, and the reason why we are not publishing that much lately is because we're really busy. Uh, I'm really busy for my coming up exams and uh, it's really tough and yeah. and been studying a lot. So, yeah, work and study, work exactly. and study. And me, it's just work. Yeah, and she can't really just record it on her own. Exactly, you know, it's, it's just, Italy. I'm just not working, just normally. <laughs> I hope you can tell right now, but I'm looking at myself in that little screen thing. I feel like I've got a little bit brown. You think I so? feel a little bit sun-kissed. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hold on, wait. She's got a bit of muscle too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, ah! you, you can tell you can the see line. My sleeve. Oh, no. <laughs> That's annoying. I have to walk around like this from now on. <laughs> Yesterday I was carrying Ricardo's little sister Emma, who's six, I think. Seven? Six. One of those. Six. I was carrying her for like ages because she was sad about something and wouldn't stand. And then at the end of it I felt like, what's that called? Like the pump or something. Where you've been like training your muscles and your arms are so long that they've like grown. That's what it was like. I was like, do you not just love her freckles? They're so nice. They're so, I don't know if you can actually see it, but uh, I love Cora's freckles. Freckles. She's very freckling. 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 I'm freckling. It's so nice. Okay, I don't know if we spoke about this in the past before, but we've been trying to book flights over to America. And- Because uh, in the New Year video, we did say we wanted to go to America this Yes. Year. Oh, that's what we said. Yes. Yeah. But the funny thing is that we tried for months, we've been after those flights and uh, we finally found it on a morning. The, the offer was on for like two or three hours and we've been trying to buy it for like with a PayPal or a credit card. It was a times. really, really good offer. Like oh, probably the best offer you'd ever find. Yeah, like 150 one way. Yeah, so in total it worked out to 740 for both of us. Return. Return to Utah. Yeah, which is really expensive if you go there. Um, never thought it would be, but yeah, yeah. it is really Normally expensive. Normally it's about 1,200 per person, but yeah. 
per person for August. And so we've been following these tickets. We found it 700 and more anyway. We tried to pay with PayPal, it didn't work. We tried with the credit card, it didn't work. So it was only three months later that we received an email saying that our flight time was changed. And I was like, what? We don't really have a yeah. flight to America. Ricardo like messaged me like, check out the email that I just got. Like, what's it all about? Yeah, am I, am I reading properly? <laughs> I was like, I actually yeah. don't believe it. No, well then I went online to like the British Airways website to check the booking number that we had. And we had a flight. <laughs> yeah, then I called as well because I still couldn't believe it. And they said, yeah, you actually have it. And I was like, how does it happen? Like, we tried and they said it didn't work. And they said, no, it actually went through. I was like, but this is so weird. Yeah. And then guess what? Four or five months later, um, we received another email saying that the payment was on hold and for the flight to America. And I was like, wait, hold on. What's going on? So I, I went, I called them and I found out that even the PayPal that we tried to pay with, it was, it went through, but it was on hold, so they didn't take the money yet. So I said, hey, hold everything. And then and they were like, well, do you, do you still want both of them? I was like, why would I want the same flight for the same person? Like two, why would I pay double? Like, that, that makes no sense. Uh, uh, I said, no, please, just delete the other one. Which one? Well, the, the one that didn't go through, obviously, not the one that did. Anyway, it was painful, but we finally made it. So we are going to America for the first time for me and probably and multiple times. Yeah. <laughs> but it's going to be the first time for me. And we probably, we're still planning on what to do exactly, but we're probably thinking to go for a week in Utah and then a week in California. Yeah. Because I would really like to go to Hollywood. 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 Thinking in Italian. <laughs> Hollywood. So we're gonna plan that all out and see what goes on as my I'd also like to see my brother who lives over there. So the weather has really gone up here in Italy and I'm sweating and it's super hot so can't really have any fans on during the filming this. During the filming this. <laughs> we'll see you in the next video guys. Bye! Bye! Bye.